now we are going to turn towards the types of the polynomial there are two main types one is the self polynomial and the second one cross polynomial see here self polynomial means see here the diagrams there is the feminine reproductive organ which is a place centrally in the flower and the third region it is a male reproductive organ that is the autosomal placenta here transfer of pollen from the mature anther to the stigma of the mature gynoecium in the same flower then it is known as a self pollination then it is known as a self pollination means without any agent see here again transfer of the pollen of the mature anther to the stigma of the female reproductive carpel mature carpel of the same flower such types of the pollination is known as the self pollination self pollination it is also known as a homogamy homo means the same one gamete means gamete there is a male gamete and female gamete male gamete which produces the pollen grains female gamete which produces the gynoecia it is known as a homogamy here homogamy is of again two types that is the autogamy that is the autogamy see here autogamy transfer of the pollen from the mature anther to the transfer to the receptive stigma of the carpel of the same flower then it is known as the autogamy self pollination autogamy self pollination example this of the mirabilis again argimo that is the argimo here autogamy means transfer of the one other means to the stigma receptive stigma of the carpel of the same flower it is known as a autogamy and examples are the mirabilis and argimo second one geotonomy gamy g e i t o n o g e n o y geotonomy means n e i g h b o u r neighbor means then the initial flowers that is the male flower from the anthers the pollen grains are transfer to the female flower the male flower have the stigma which receives the pollen grains with the transfer of pollen grains from the anthers mature anthers to the receptive stigma of the carpel of the same flower which is a near neighbor of the same plant it is known as the geneto gamy example is a 
Chia maize. That is, it is known as the maize. It is known as the maize. Means, main preparation structure that is the uh, anthers which produce the pollen grains and these pollen grains are transferred to the stigma of the receptive of the carpet of the same flower that is the unisexual flowers. Then it is known as the genodo means Genodo means uh, neighbor of the same flowers. Second type that is the cross pollination. Here this cross here cross means the different the transfer of pollen grains transfer of pollen grains to the stigma of another flower of the carpet of the same species of the same species it is known as a cross pollination means there are some controversies of the cross pollination therefore the transfers from one flower to the another flower the stigma it is known as a cross pollination cross pollination is known as one known as the genogan here, genogamy, right? This is genogamy, which consists that is the this one female flower, then it is a male flower, transfer of the pollen grains from the one flower to the stigma of the another flower. It is known as the genogamy. It is of the same species. And for this transfer of pollen grain requires some energy for transfer. And the energy is carried by means of the different agents. Here, for the pollination, again, different agents are essential. Different agents here agents for the pollination agents for pollination. It is required to carry. It is required to carry. Here agents for it is a two type. One is a Abiotic agents. Abiotic agents. These are abiotic means that is a non-living. And these abiotic agents consist the edemic and the climatic factors. Climatic factors that is when wind and water. They are most important agents for the pollination. After maturations of the both the flowers, same times or different times, the wind and the water is essential for the pollination. So pollen grains they are very carried by means of the wind. They are very small, light in weight, and they are easily carried by means of the slight movement of the air from the one flower to the another flower of the same species such agents they are known as a body agents then water is a, a, another agent for the pollination and this water means the plants which grow in the water or water saturated substratum they are known as hydrophytes in this hydrophytes the plants that is a pollinated, that is a male flower, that is a pollen grain to the stigma receptor of the 
another flower the same flower due to with the help of this water current then it is known as the hydro it is known as the hydro a second agent that is the biotic agent biotic agent biotic agents means the living one bios living organisms biotic agents means the living one here living one consists of different agents here we are going to say that is the biotic agent Biotic agents. That is the uh, first. We are going to say that is the uh, zoophily. Pollination takes place by means of the animals. Different types of the animals. It is a uh, carry from one place to the animal to the another. They are known as the zoophily. then it is known as the entomophily here pollination takes place pollen grains are pollinated by means of the different uh, insect they are known as the uh, entomophily then another gorinothophily See, in this ornithophily, the pollination takes place due to the same different uh, bars. Fourth uh, type that is uh, C H I R O N T H O phily. Chiranthophily means pollination takes place by means of the bats and last the agent that is the malacophily m a l a c o p h i l y malacophily different snails which are essential see here for the agents that is the biotic agents consist the animals insects birds bats snails means when the pollen grains are transferred from the mature anther to the stigma of the another flower through the animals it is known as the zoophily when the pollen grains are transferred to the receptive stigma of the carpel of the another flower by agents through the insects known as the entomophily pollen grains from the mature anther to the stigma of the receptive of the same flower or different flower from this birds through birds known as the ornithophily pollen grains transport by means of the bats known as the chiranthophily last one that is the transfer of pollen from the bats to the snails known as the malacophily means for the pollination the requires some that is the agents and the agents they are attracted to the flowers that is suppose one that is the insects when insects visit when the flower which have in the main accessory hole that is the known as the corolla and when the corolla is a larger in size and it is a bright scented and it attracts the insects again that the male reproductive organ female reproductive organ consists sugary substances to suck the sugar the insects are pollinated or what they are take by one flower to the Another flower, and along with its uh, body, 
the pollen grains that is the sticky substances to the sticky substances pollen grains are attached to and they are they are carried from one plant to the another plants means here for the attractions again that is a corolla and then the female reproductive structure male reproductive structure sugar substances then that is also that is known as the calyx and to sit it requires the insect to different other parts to the stage to sit on the flower and to suck the honey or sugar substances again flowers are also part the larger in size then there is a cross pollination this place and through this the biotic agents they are take part in the pollination of the flowers